collaboration with a Canadian music producer uh, who provided the ambient music. And the visual images with that ambient music uh, is designed to create a sense of um, peace and reflection and also to be in the moment in terms of experiencing a visual image in a way that you probably don't normally do it. Um, all of my work or my recent work is really about the inner space, uh, the inner journey, uh, self-discovery if you like, um, and this experience is hopefully to encourage people to reflect on on the experience that they're having when they're viewing it, why they might like it, why they don't like it, what type of uh, emotions it might evoke. It may not evoke any emotions and that might be worth exploring as well. Um, overall, the images are about the joy of life, uh, the joy of liveliness and, and uh, love and uh, this human experience. Uh, and a number of them around the room have also been inspired by the beautiful region in which I live, which is the Wollonga Basin. Uh, the coming together of hills and sea and vines. Um, there's a number of paintings that uh, reflect that. The joy of living in such a rich, beautiful uh, place on, on, the, on the earth. And uh, once again, um, I'm not interested in capture, making anything look real. It's about, uh, I guess, emotions and feelings and um, presence. The presence of the environment creates a, a joy for me, which is expressed in an abstract way. And I, I think the other thing about abstract expressionism, expressionism is uh, it is designed to engage the viewer in a different way. So they can't make value judgments about whether this is a, a lovely tree. They can look at the image and draw upon their own experiences to somehow relate to the image, uh, which may be a reflection of some emotional experience or values that, that they may have. So it's aimed, to, it's aimed to connect the good things in our lives. Look, I guess when I look at this uh, art, I realise that um, it has been influenced by my, my career journey, I guess. So I, I was a teacher for a decade. Uh, part of that was teaching primary school, but also uh, obviously art. And I love children's art. I love the directness and the spontaneity and the authenticity of children's art. So um, in a sense, I try to emulate that. Um, not as well as children, but the joy uh, uh, hopefully is there. This exhibition is part of the Fringe and is open from the 11th of February through to the 6th of March. Um, Monday to Friday, 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. and Sunday the 20th, 27th and the 6th of March between 1 p.m. and 4 p.m. I'll be here uh, with my muse, my wife, uh, on those Sunday afternoons. So if you want to come in and uh, have a chat, I'd uh, love to see you.